Come on, stay on. Hey, hey. <laughs> We are off. <sighs> All right, so shows in this location here. Um, we're just going to cast into there. It just dips off a bit, so I'm hoping something will just be waiting on the edge of that. Something just darted across, but my line's right there. Something just darted across there. It could just be a little fish because there's a few around here. Oh, yeah, look, just a frenzy down there. Look at that. Look at this. These fish are just attacking my prawn. Hey! At least that's a bit further out. Reeling in. And we're baited. That is a good sign. I like that. There wasn't any more action in this section, so I walked around a bit to try and find a better spot but there wasn't really anything that would give me good access to the water. So I eventually just decided to move on. All right, we're going to a new location because time is of the essence. Oh, a stingray. Look at that! Oh, right over him. Hope you guys saw that. stand here. We probably could but it would be best if we didn't have to go in the water. Oh, it's a bit more shallow than this. Oh perfect. I just cast it right there. I'm hoping there'll be something just waiting in the drop off. Oh my, oh my gosh. Holy mackerel. Do you guys see that? We're putting in, we're putting stuff in there. That was instant. That was an instant bite, my friend. I'm shaking, that was crazy. Perfect, perfect spot once again. All right. Oh. Oh. Come on, take it. Oh. This process where the fish would just keep ripping my prawn off the hook happened again and again and again with the same result each time so I was just constantly getting baited. 
we're gonna just cast that section because there's loads of splashes going on there. So I'll just try and get it right on. In an effort to preserve my prawns, I tried casting in a slightly different section. However, this change did not help one bit. All right, so I decided to move along from that spot. I was casting in there and over there. Uh, we just, my battery for the GoPro is on 13%. So I'm just gonna see if there's any, like a perfect place to cast and then put something in there. You don't want to come out empty handed, hey. I reckon if I cast it in there, there'd be something. For sure. For sure as eggs. Alright, I'm going to do that. Right, we're just going to cast in there. Like that. Now we just wait. And hope that this spot gives us something good. Not an instant bite, but that's all right. Perfect, perfect spot. Oh, we're on, we're on, we're on. We're freaking on. Oh my gosh. Come on, stay on. Hey, hey, <laughs> we got something. Hey, that's awesome. Oh, that's a good looking whiting. Probably a bit small, but we got one. Okay, calm down, mate. Oh, that is awesome. Less than 10% battery left also. All righty, we'll just release this guy. Just got him around the lip, so it's a good, good catch, and he should be able to release quite easily. Ready? There we go. Look at him. Oh, and he's up. Oh, let's go. That's awesome. Small but easy catch. At least this whole thing wasn't just a waste. Um, yeah, I wasn't expecting to be onto something just there, but that's awesome. Yeah, I'm gonna head back now. Oh, that's good. I haven't caught a fish at Noosa for so long, so I'm really pleased with that. Um, yeah, I'm gonna head back home now because I know GoPro doesn't have much battery left. Um, yeah, and I'll try and do some more fishing while I'm here. Um, I really wanna put it back in those spots over there and there, but we'll see how we go with that. Um, but yeah, Woo. Sure enough, I went fishing again while I was at Noosa, but I didn't have much luck at all. So I decided on the last day to take the stand-up paddleboard back to the same section in the mangroves and try and catch those fish that were just baiting me and were not giving me any luck at all. So here's how the rest of the video panned out. So we're back on the stand-up paddleboard. We're gonna go to the same section where we got those big bites from a few days ago. All right, gonna have to walk this section because it is real shallow. To not get the paddle in very far at all. All right, so we've landed where we got those bites the other day. We caught that other fish up there. Um, it's much more shallow than it was a few days ago. That might impact us a bit, but we're still gonna throw in over there. Pretty severe drop off. Yeah, there'll be stuff in there for sure. Really, Short casts should do the trick. We're just gonna plonk it right there. It was more of the same thing from the other day here with big bites and no reward. Because of this, I decided to try the other section where I got similar bites 
from the other day. Put in that section just there. Oh, oh my gosh. We're on. Hold on, he's off, he's off. Hold on, he's on. We're on. Oh, no way. Oh, no. No, 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 no. He just took it all. He just took everything. Oh, no. He was on too. He was on. Oh, no, bro. I might, I'm gonna paddle back. I need to paddle back and get another rod. I'm coming back here. I'll be back. <sighs> All right, we're back. Got a new rod. Still got our same bait, but we're gonna head out to the same spot. Catch that fish that took our bait and our, and our hook and our sinker. All right, we're off. Um, we're gonna go to the same spot and try and catch that pesky fish because otherwise it'll haunt me. I've got like an hour to try and catch this fish, so I'll try and be as efficient as possible. Efi efficient as possible. <laughs> yeah. Righty, made it back. Throw straight in there. I think. Well, I was just talking to a guy just then, and. We've deduced that it's probably a cod, so it'd be nice to reel in one of those that tastes good apparently, so. Oh my gosh, did you see that massive pool? Oh, hold on, still interested. I think, oh, he just jumps on and off. After that one massive bite, the fish became more careful and decided to only nibble at the bait. So I quickly realised that I had to move on if I wanted any chance of catching another fish. We're moving to just a different spot. Over there where we caught the whiting the other day. Right in here. Come on. Something wants it. Something just needs to take it. Come on, look at that. Yeah, we're on. Yeah, yeah, we've got something. We've got something, guys. What is it? A miniature yeah. brim. Oh, okay, that's a little, uh, that's very uh, underwhelming. We're catching lots of little fish here. You are very tiny, my friend. Woo! <laughs> we caught something. It's really underwhelming. I'd like something a bit, a bit more significant. All right, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna cast in there again. That's a promising sign. Yep, so I've cast it in again in the same section. Hopefully we can get another fish. Oh, interest, interest. Oh, holy mackerel. This is a good fish. This has got to be a good fish. Come on. Come on. Oh, yes, that's a cod, that's a cod. Yes, he's really small. He's really quite small, but that, that is okay. That's a cod. Not the massive one we were hoping for. Ah, that's all right. Okay, let's have a look here. 
That's a cod, my friends. I can see it in him. Come on, come on. Hold on. Yeah, we're getting this. It's coming. There we go. Woo! Look at him. Oh, that's wicked. That right over there. Good place to catch them, apparently. He's definitely undersized, so he's not the massive one we were hoping for. But a catch is a catch. Oh no! <laughs> there we go. That's a good release. Woo! Awesome. All right. Heading back home now. Gosh. Look at that sunset. I mean, it's not much of a sunset, but at least it's like golden hour. The sun is shining through real nicely. So stoked with, with that catch. Um, I'll come back and go to that same section next time I'm at Noosa because I reckon there's gonna be a big fish in there. But yeah, um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next couple of videos because they are pretty cool. All right, see you guys.